we are going to see how to connect the PG admin or Postgres admin to the database, the Postgres database deployed on Railway app. It's very simple, it's not so intuitive, but it's very simple. So, first of all, we are going to create our Postgres database on Railway. What you need? Postgres. We can double click here to see our deploys logs. It's deploying. So, our Postgres database is deployed, and here we have some crucial information. Here we have our database name, database directory, database name, database host, just, just for internal use this. And we have our Postgres password port, just for internal use too, our Postgres user, and Postgres uh, database and Postgres password and blah blah blah. So now we need to go to our PG admin. So let's jump to it. PG admin. Uh, here I am using the version 4 of PG admin. So we are going to connect a new server. And here in servers, click right click and go to register server. Here in the name, we can put whatever name we want okay in the connection tab in here host slash address here is the big tip for our connection we go back to our Portuguese variables and here we copy this database public URL why because in this public URL we have all the data that we need we have our database name we have our port we have our password we have our postgres user so first of all we are going to connect before the add we are going to copy this url so we copy it and we paste it okay in the port it's not 5432 it's not we have to use the public port that is one six three six three so we copy and we paste it and the database it's railway so we paste it the user is postgres the password is this we copy and we paste it okay my my apologize guys postgres user my mistake my bad so postgres and the password is pasted here so we can put it side by side and here you are going to see we have our URL we have our port we have our database name we have our user and we have our password okay now we are going to save it save it it's saving and it's connecting this is it we have connect or remote railway app Postgres database this is it I got no tables here there's no there's no table but now you can go back to Postgres database and you can create our tables or if you are using ORM like Prisma like I do you can create in backend uh, app server and you can create the, your your Prisma schema to create your tables so this is it guys just for conclusion, we create our Postgres database on Railway here in Create App. We double click and we had access to our informations. We copy the public URL, we paste it on our text editor. Here we connect our URL here. This is the port, this is the database, this is our user, and this is our Postgres admin. Okay, I hope you enjoy it and bye-bye.